it's like 1.30 in the morning, so I'm gonna try to be really quiet. No, I'm just kidding. Welcome back to Dot Hack. Okay, so we are here. I have power leveled. Oops. Yeah, well, we've already saw it. We've already seen this. I have power leveled and I'm ready to go. The mail I sent you. Yet, however, it's too late. Yet, however. There's something I have to ask you. Do you bleach blonde your- do you bleach your hair? Or is it natural? Cause I only date natural white haired chicks. I gotta say though, I love the way Mona Marsha- uh, well, yeah. I love the way Mona Marshall yells no. She's actually very good at it. There's very few people that actually yell the word no and like hold it and it sounds good. She can do it. So props to Mona Marshall for being able to do that. But yeah, uh, I am about five levels stronger than I was when I tried this the first time. So I should be good. I'm level 33. Level 33, Mistral and Black Rose both have 25 resurrects, and we are far stronger. So hopefully, this should go better. Ding! And I love this scene. This is so cool. I like how you like we're like diving into the matrix and stuff. It's very cool. And I don't know, there's something about when that scene happens, uh, you know, when you're moving through the, the code or whatever, and there's like two halves, it's kind of mesmerizing. It's kind of a mesmerizing effect, and it looks very cool. I love it. Okay, so this time it ought to go... Oh, yeah, check that out. I survived a hit. Uh, I'm not going to survive this, though. Oh, wow, he missed. <laughs> nice. Okay, now... Okay, so skills, skills, uh, Mistral, first aid. There we go. Is this enemy strong? Wow, killed her already. Damn, all right. Resurrect. Damn, look at that. Okay. Oh, nothing from Mistral. Okay. I think I might die from this, but who knows. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Oh, heh heh, I live. Nice. Did you just kill her? Oh, man. There we go. There. Let's do that. And now Black Rose is actually able to tank a little bit. She can actually take a hit without just melting. Not Mistral, though, she can't, sadly. Boom! Check that out. Man, that's great. No, no, no. Uh, actually. There. Uh, if Mistral could just survive one of his hits, it would be great, because then I could actually have her cast a spell or two. That'd be, that'd be pretty nice. <laughs> when she says that, I feel like she's saying Zabuza from uh, Naruto. Damn it. Hayabusa. I don't know why she called. I don't. What? I don't understand her pronunciation of that. God, it's weird. It's like when people try to pronounce a Japanese name and they don't know how it's like they don't know how to pronounce uh, Japanese things. Uh, let's see here. Skills. I want to do Gale of Swords. Yeah! Hey, she's gonna die. Oh. Well, she's not gonna die. Okay. I was I was just about to give her a uh, Mage of Soul, but not anymore. Because he's right next to her, and that won't matter. No, no, no. Ah, crap. Okay. Drink on me. Health drink on me. Ah, oh, resurrect on Black Rose the instant he takes her down. <laughs> like, yeah, now you know what it feels like to be in an MMO when we just res each other in the middle of combat. It kind of sucks, doesn't it, ass? All right. Don't waste your resurrects, please. Those are quite valuable. Skills, Gale of Swords. Oh, I hate you. That's so cheap. Okay, time for a data drain. Who, 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 who? Is it Black Rose? Come on, Black Rose. 
Oh, it's me! Crap, that's not very good, actually. Boop! Owie, my face. Okay, first aid. Come on, there we go. Ow! Okay, fine. Resurrect me. Okay, so now each of them, along with Mistral's Rip Mean, um, both of them have 25 uh, Resurrects, along with however many they had from the first attempt, because they were reviving me, and I never gave them a Resurrect over the course of the whole game. So I don't know how they were able to heal me, but they did. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Heal Mistral. Damn, I killed her just like that. Okay, fine. Oh my god, stop with the friggin' attacks, man. Jeez. Now, I'll tell ya, uh, there are two phases to this fight. The first phase is definitely, definitely the hardest. So, if you can get through this, uh, the rest of it is like a complete joke. So, yeah, just putting that out there. Man, I really wish I had a magic potion. You know, the one that heals 400? Man. Okay, swirling dark. Thank you for not being an ass. Oh, I hate you. Alright, who are you data draining? Is it me again? I hope it's not me. Oh, stop data draining me! You're an ass. Alright, here, let's. Can I skip it? No, I can't. I'm actually pressing the button I would use that you skip scenes with and it doesn't work. Alright. Good. Ow, god damn. Alright, heal me. There we go. It's like, please heal me. <laughs> I was getting worried there because Black Rose is about to die. Man, just quit with the skills. And especially because they take so long. Like, man. No, resurrect. There we go. Good. Okay, Mistral is dead. Oh, man. Okay, resurrect Mistral. Oh, God, it just never ends. Man, this is such a, this is such a tedious fight. Just because of all these frigging skills he uses. And they always stop the action. All right, uh, items, health drink. Man, I've gone through about 20 or 30 of these so far. Okay, health drink, black rose, black rose, there. Ooh, ooh, here, got him! Suck it! Time to date and have a taste of your own damn medicine! Hell yeah! There he is! That is Skaith right there. That's it. That is what Skaith actually is. He's just like a collection of weird glowing rocks. Ow, that kind of hurts. Okay. Uh, also, when you get him to this point, that does not mean drop your guard. Still be careful, but it's, it isn't as hard, but again, be careful. Oh, crap. Uh, Mistral is asleep. Let's go ahead and wake her up. And then I'm going to go ahead and hit her with a Mage of Soul. So she can start healing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Uh, heal me. Thank you. Okay. Ow, that hurts a lot more than it used to. Man. Scathe, first form Scathe, only hit like a hundred or so with that the first time, but now he's hitting like 300. Okay, come on. <sighs> okay, now she is paralyzed, paralyzed, and now I'm going to go ahead and use a Major Soul skills. Look at this, man. We're taking him down. Come on. Don't worry. I know I'm about to die. 
Oh, stop healing. Oh, good. Somebody got a crit. Ow. God damn, you hurt. For a collection of glowing rocks, you kind of hurt. Yeah, stop him in his tracks. We got this shit now. Oh, you think just slowing me is going to slow me down? Well, guess what? I got speed charms off camera. And Mr. All is dead. Oh, my God. This is not particularly good. Whoop, 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 whoop. Suck it. Whoop, 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 whoop. Boom. Oh, wow. Uh, first aid, first aid, first aid. Thank God. <laughs> Boom. Kill him. Yeah. Black Rose, stop, stop blinking. It's annoying. Kubia. We had come so far, but we knew so little, and now the true battle was about to begin. Oh shit, that's the end? Only of the first game. So we got three left. So we got three games. Oh, and this is pretty cool. You can actually, if you're, if you have really good eyes, you can actually find the names here. Uh, oh yeah, no. Once they start listing more names at a time, you can actually find them. Yes, yeah, I managed to find story background right there. But yeah, once they start listing a lot of names, you can actually find it in the jumble of text. It's cool because they uh, they list the Japanese voice actors and they... Uh, oh yeah, see? Elk is Brian Siddle. So, there you go. Um, 
Oh, yep, and uh, Mr. All was Sandy Fox. You can go back and look. Moonstone? Wait, who's Moonstone? Wait. I don't know. Is he somebody you meet later? I think so. But, um... God. That thing, Kubia, since... Oh, Michelle Ruff was in this? Where was she? Where the hell was Michelle Ruff? Oh, anyway. Um... Because they said the name. It's not really a spoiler at this point. That thing's name, that big blue floating spiky thing, alien looking thing, that's uh, Kubia. The thing looks so creepy with like the blue glowing antlers and the see-through membrane leading to like that big pulsing heart thing and the friggin' like six eyes or whatever. Or wait, was it three eyes or six? I don't remember. It had, mold it had more than two eyes, I know that. And then, of course, oh, Helba's hovering there ominously. She knows what's going down. I don't actually remember if she does. But, well, I mean, at, at this point, I don't remember if she does or not. <sighs> and don't worry, I know that, um, oh, this whole thing with Scaife, I know that's basically not even really been addressed. You know, like, you don't know what the hell Scaith is, you don't know what Phase 1 Scaith, the Terror of Death, even means. You know, there's no context for that. Not really, not yet. But I can promise you, it gets all, it all gets explained. So don't worry. You don't need to worry about things not making any sense, because we still have three games to go. There's still, um, let me think. It's dot .hack, Infection, Mutation... Outbreak and then quarantine. Next up will be mutation. So uh, I do intend to do uh, two of these games in a row. I'll leave the other two for another time. It's probably it's not going to be that long. Don't worry. It might be like a one game interval, you know, something like that. So uh, that way I just don't burn out on Dot Hack. So yeah. So you can expect the next game to come very soon, and then a slight break between uh, that one and um, Outbreak. And then Outbreak and Quarantine will be back to back. And then after that, I will eventually move on. Yeah. Uh, no, I think it's four. I think it might be four eyes because they have like, it has another two on where its forehead would be. Um, ugh, excuse me. Um, and then after, after I finish this, the quadrilogy, um, I'll move on to GU at some point. Okay, so .hack.com. Anything else? I think there might be like an epilogue cutscene. Oh, no. You now have the data flag for .hack slash slash infection. Save? Okay. So, go ahead and save. And now you will add the data flag to your file. And see how it turns yellow? That means you've beaten the game. And hey, I did it way faster than my original time. I think my original time was like 34 hours or something. So there you go. Go ahead and save. And you now have the, you now have the data flag. And we got more news. Let's see. Success in cultivation of apples. Zanyo Ring Research Institute said today that they have succeeded in cultivating a new type of apple with increased nutritional content. The taste and texture of the prototype are both good, but nothing like an apple. Some tasters have commented that it's very bland and dry. Okay. <laughs> Bigfoot. A massive Bigfoot investigation began in the suburb of Redding in a suburb of Redding in Oregon State today. There have been many sightings of Bigfoot recently, and city officials hope it will revive tourism in the area. Although they have been unable to capture the creature, the BBQ, or the barbecue party, featuring local mountain recipes was a great success. <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess that's it, because it's no more new. Ooh! Roy at Bandai. Cleared game data. Congratulations on the clearing .hack infection. You now have the data flag. Game data saved in this condition, in yellow, can be imported into the next volume data without the data flag will not be imported, so please be careful. You may continue with your adventure with the current data. Main story will not proceed. Items and experience items and experience obtained after clearing can be imported to the next volume, so you can strengthen your character before you continue with the story. That is very cool. 
and Giant of the Heavens. Have you seen the mystical giant in the heavens of Delta areas? Or, yeah, Delta areas. According to rumors, the aerial fleet transporting the giant thousands of years ago was in an accident, and now wanders with the giant forever. Hideous someone's giant. Use this keyword to solve the mystery of the cursed fleet wandering the heavens. I forgot to tell you, but I added a virus key... Virus core T in your items. Okay, cool. Ardenia. Octopi are kind of funny. You can't blame them for anything. Hmm? What are you talking about? Huh? What do you like about octopi? Uh... Did you mean something else? <laughs> that that would be me. Huh. Okay. Audio. Let's see here. You can do all the movies now. You can watch all of them. So that's the opening. Oh, opening. The epitaph. That's the uh, the one where Scathe was being chased in the dungeon when you were still with Orca. That's the one with... Uh, wait, what is this one? Let's watch it. Oh. Oh, yeah. It's this one where uh, the data drain. Right. Okay, enemy's death, I mean, enemy's return, death of Orca, even though he's not dead, he's just in a coma. Uh, friend or foe, woman in white, first comrade, Black Rose, in the Sanctum Goblin, okay, and White Knight and Data Bug. Okay, so that's all the movies, uh, we've already seen them, they're basically just the story movies, they're not anything special, it's not like little unlockable anime cutscenes or anything like that, so... Yeah, we're basically done with this game. At this point, now that we have the data flag, we can take the data from this game, which includes our level progress and all of our items, and we can import it into .hack mutation. And we will be able to start from there. Now, I don't actually know how .hack infection... Oh, well, I don't actually know how it works if you play one of the later games first, because I don't know if you start out at level 1 and then whatever or if you start at a base level or whatever but i've never done that so if you're gonna play this game if you have the money and you can actually track down a working copy of this game i highly recommend starting with the first game and moving on up through the normal um you know through chronological order <sighs> so i would like to thank all of you for watching um next time i'm probably gonna do the um the stupid little flying mummy dungeon, because that's what that's the whole someone's giant thingy. So I'm gonna do that, and then uh, I'm gonna be done with dot hack infection, and then we will move on to dot hack uh, mutation. I really hope I'm actually, I'm pretty sure the next one is mutation. I really hope it's mutation, because I don't honestly remember. So uh, next time we'll do the mummy. We'll do the special dungeon. So see you then.